Greetings, this is Bloodrill and welcome back to Let's Play Dreamfall Chapters. And let's continue. I just got into the city with uh, Kian, so I have three goals. I'm not sure which is closest, but we'll see. We'll do some exploring first. See what is there is to see. Hmm. Brewery. Can you wonder? No. Right. Like the design on these houses. Mercuria. Alright, we are at the old town. And then there are the bones, the cold stone. Double square, fire skip. Hmm. It has number as well. German Inn. That is the in April and they landed in the bones, okay? Uh South Gate, Magic Ghetto, it's it's where I am actually. Alright. Sadie Que so I should go do that first. Should be on my right. Somewhere. Nope, can't go there. Is that? I don't think I can go that way. Yeah. Nope. Hmm. What was it, right? Yeah, that seems to be it. Hmm. Maybe I need to find the back way or something. Oh. Alright, let's go this way. The mole's expecting you. Huh. You'll wait your turn in the back. Don't speak unless spoken to. And no funny business. Alright? What the fuck is talking? Alright, that guy. I was wondering who the fuck is talking. He's not doing a very good job of being inconspicuous. But maybe that's the idea. Alright, let's go in. And speak to them all. Merely an unfortunate side effect, Madam Mole. I... I don't expect... Unfortunate side effect? Is lot more than unfortunate side effect. Is mud-riddled catastrophe is what is. Everyone in bar sleep. Everyone who drink wine, close eyes and start snore. Not good for business. Well, yes, we put too much of the poppy stem in the mix. I blame the... Don't care. Responsibility on you. You cause disaster, you fix disaster. Poppy stem only to make wine more good, give spice, make more people buy wine. This, this make people not buy wine. This make people sleep and not drink any more wine. Make people buy other wine. This is bad thing, not good thing. Bad, bad thing. So, you fix. How you will fix? Oh, well, see, that's the problem. We've we've run out of poppy stem. It all... it went into that one shipment. Earth, save us from you lot. Without poppy stem, our wine just wine. Nothing extra. No spice. Very well. You get Eden Song from City Green. It grow there. Goat eat it. Goat love it. Goat get dizzy and fall over. Goat never know when enough is enough. Not same as poppy stem, even song. 
but we'll do for now. Make wine more special again. Thank you, madam. I'll... Mix right amount next time. Not too little or no spice, and not too big, or everyone go sleep. And if everyone sleep, you sleep. You sleep long sleep. Final sleep. Um, oh, right. God, yes, yes, I... Thank you, my lady, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Cool. What are you doing, Azadi? Hmm? Come out of shadow. Let me see you. So it's a real mold then. It's not just a name. All right. She I must know it. who I am and why I'm here. Maybe she wasn't informed of my visit. Maybe she has no idea I'm with yeah, the resist. The creature it. clearly harbors a lot of animosity towards my people. Perhaps that's understand. She must know who I am. We need your help. You need something. I need something. Everyone needs something. Let me tell you how my operation work. You do something for me. I do something back. His only way is never first. Never, never first. Because I am the mole. So sing your song. Let me know what you need. And then hear what I need. Come mm. on, come on. I'm asking for help to fight the Azadi. Wouldn't that count as doing for you? But you are Azadi. I am. An apostle. I was. <laughs> I'm not like human. Azadi, they are worse than lot. How I know Azadi not playing me. How I know you not playing me. Goddess, save us all. I am Kian Alvani. I was the apostle, but now I'm a rebel. I'm here to make my people leave the Northlands and return to Azadir, and to ensure our so-called leaders stand trial for their crimes. I don't know. Smell like trap. But let us pretend you speak truth. What you want with the mole? I was told you could help us with weapons and supplies. Maybe the mole can help with weapon, maybe she cannot. But before this question answered, you help me with something. Scratch back. Scratch? He's just saying. Not want your oversized hand all over back. Favour for me. Favour for you in turn. What do you need? Need to intercept runner. Messenger who pass word between guard station and city. There is letter I need. You help Mole do this, Mole will consider your problem. I can do that. Good for you, Apostle no more. One condition. This runner. You will not hurt him. I will not. Why not? They use young men for runners. Boys. They have fought no battles, killed no rebels or magicals. They don't deserve to die. They are still enemy. I need your promise. I promise, I promise. No one hurt your little runner. My man there will mark place on map where runner pass. From there you find place to take message from runner with no guard watching. Remember, no one must see. Very important, this. You take letter from runner, we get letter from you, everyone goes separate way, everyone happy. When job done, talk to the mole again. The mole will be ready to talk business. All right. I wonder what sort of magical this one is. I've heard soldiers returning from the northern forests talk about the mole people who burrow into the mud. What are you? What I am, he asked. What I am, <laughs> I am the mole. That's rather rude. That's not the name of your species. My species, he say. The Azadi, always so tactful, always so sensitive. In my tongue, that name be Banda Banta. It ah, means right. I remember. Those guys. Like this. this fancy way of saying we live in mud. Know many song and dig deep tunnel. So we are mole, 
dig dweller, digger, mole with fancy name, who speak and sing and also magic. Except a Zardy come and put fire and smoke in Banda Tunnel. And when Banda come out, a Zardy slaughter. Every one of us, man, woman, child, infant, no mole spared, except me. Well, get up. Left me for dead. I am last of species, Azadi. Last of people. Last of Banda Banta. Last of Mole. I am the Mole. And now you go and come back only when finished. Go. Shoot. Leave. You know door. Easy to find. Still open. Well. So then I'll ask that. Mole's map. Alright, cool. Uh, I need to do the optional thing in the bones, alright? Let's see the map again. Can I, yeah. Checkpoint, runner's path. So I need to intercept before the checkpoint, or should I intercept at the checkpoint? I don't actually remember. Uh, we'll see, I guess. Not sure how that works exactly. Alrighty. You're in the magic ghetto, right? It's just that you don't look like you're from the ghetto. How will I know where the hell he is? That's the problem. It's gonna be problematic. And I can't actually make a manual save, so maybe we'll have to be lucky. tried to steal my purse. So? You're a Zardi. That's the worst excuse ever for stealing a purse. You could get your arm chopped off. So far, so good. Lucky for you, I'm not a Zardi. Now scram. How tall are you? You're really tall. Leave me alone, boy. You're a lot taller than my dad. Are you sure you're not a Zardi? Yes. You look a Zardi. Are you a soldier? Why aren't you in uniform? Jesus. Are you secret police? What? No. Run off before I lose my patience with you. You sure look like one of them. Oh, for the love of the goddess. What's your name, boy? Bip. Bip? Yeah. So? You should be with your mother, Bip. Not out on your own, thieving. Go home. <laughs> Can't. I ain't Bip. got one. Uh. I'm sorry. You should still not... They're not dead or anything. Uh, my parents. They were just sent to Guillen. Guillen. That's where the Magicals are sent. They don't come back from there. But the boy must know this already. He must have seen it happening to others. Oh yeah, let's tell him your, uh, your parents are dead. The boy probably has no idea what happens on Guillen. I yeah. should... Yeah. What are they doing on Guillen? Re-education camp. That's what my father said. They probably didn't listen very well in school when they were children. They'll be back, when they've been properly re-educated. No one comes back from the islands. Not magicals. What do you mean? I mean... Are you saying they're going to stay there forever? Shit. <laughs> He's only a boy. But so was I when I became an orphan. No one protected me from the truth. The boy can't be more than ten. He doesn't need to know the truth just yet. Well, crap. I like how it slows time. That's very nice. 
He's only I'd like to tell you the truth. But so was I when I became an orphan. I generally no found it a better me from the truth. option in life. Ugh. He's only a boy can't be more Shit. than ten. He doesn't need to know the truth just yet. He's only they're not coming back. But why? What will happen to them? You shouldn't think of such things. Do you have no family here? Not in Mercuria. They're all in the Southlands. What's going to happen to them? They will be put to work. That's what the prison camps are for. To keep the magicals away from humans. To segregate them. Segregate? To keep magicals apart from humans. Forever. You're lying. I am not. Truly. You're one of them. Why are you here? Are you going to take me and send me to be a segre segregate? Segregated. Two. I'm not one of them. Well, you sure look and sound like them. I'm sorry about your parents, but I have things I need to do. Are you with the resistance? Uh, resistance? <laughs> <laughs> well, of course not. I'm because uh, I ever heard someone saying there's an Azadi in the resistance. He's now. so bad at this. And if you're Azadi and you're here and you have things to do, that sounds an awful lot like you're with the resistance. Keep your voice down, boy. Don't worry. Everyone in Old Town supports the resistance. Most everyone, anyway. What do you mean by most everyone? I mean that there are some who don't support the resistance, some who sneak off to National Front assemblies. Some who rat out rebels to the Azadi. Do you know anyone like that? No. Well, I don't know their faces, but I know where there's a National Front Assembly tonight. Show me. What? Show me where. I get to go on a mission with you. That's... that's... so incredibly cool! Calm down, boy. I just want you to tell me where it is. How well do you know the city? Well, not... Very. Right. So I'll show you. Too complicated to tell you. It's not safe. For you? No. For me? I leave the ghetto all the time when it's dark. I know where to go. Where the guards are posted, their patrol routes, everything. I'm like a rogue. One with the shadows. The veiled Avenger. I'm an assassin. Uh... Just show me the way and then you're coming straight back here. I'll just stay for a little while. Straight back. Or I find someone else to take me. Good luck with that. But fine, I'll come straight back. Are you ready? Can we go now? I'm not ready, actually. I should explore first. And maybe... Will you wait for me here? Oh, man. But we are going, right? Tonight? Soon. Fine. I'll wait. Alrighty. I think I'll end this episode here, thank you for watching, subscribe, like, leave a comment if you want to, and I will see you next time.